Hello everyone, I am Dr. Jyoti and my team members Shweta, Hi. Dr. Shashireka, Dr. Kavya, Hello. Ali, Hello. Mentor Dr. Sadlama. We all started our journey on November 29, 2016. The chosen department MRD and the chosen topic the study to evaluate the quality assessment of medical record in the tertiary care teaching hospital that is Ramaya Medical College Hospital. But the main purpose of choosing this particular department and the topic, all of us during our departmental study, we all could find a lot of incomplete files in the MRD department, few incompleteness in the medical audit, everything. This was like challenging for all of us for choosing this topic. So we all discussed with our mentor, Dr. Sarla ma'am, and came up with an idea to choose a particular department or to choose overall department. That was a bit confusion initial days. And later, a special thanks to Dr. Narendra Nath sir, who guided us to be in a right track. And later, we all selected to do our work by choosing all the departments of a particular month in a week. That is how we started our group project. This was a one month journey where we collected the data and later interpreted and the data analysis and the conclusion, it just happened this. Here is a video of showing the working process of our group project. It goes this way. Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Kavya. Uh, I'll be showing you the uh, MRD department. Now, right now, as we are located here in the basement. So I'll take you to the ground floor as well. This is the corridor which leads to the MRD department uh, in the basement. So I'll just go through the MRD department and let you know how it is. We'll, we'll just go have a look at the department. So this is the entrance and we come in. Uh, this is Mr. Rakshaker here. Uh, they, they all work in the uh, MRD department. Mr. Narayan Swami. Uh, Mr. Changapa, he is working on the database. Mr. Murli here, he is one of the staff who works in the MRD as well. Uh, Mr. Shamla, she has helped us a lot while retrieving our discharge files and uh, we should uh, be thankful to her. Uh, Mrs. Rosie uh, here and uh, ma'am is working here since a long time. Ma'am has also been very helpful for us. Files are being compiled here. It, it's kept in a way, it's coded, indexed and kept in a way so that it can be retrieved easily. They also have a database so that they can retrieve the files uh, even to the computer as well. So it's much quicker and they're doing a good job here. Okay, so we are done with the basement and now let's go to the ground floor. This is a staircase. Just follow me. So we see more files here. It's been compiled since years and they keep it so that they can retrieve it whenever they want. Let's get at the ground floor right now. So let's go meet the staff members here at the ad admission counter. Here we have Mrs. Shamla, who's working in the admission counter. We have Mrs. Shilpa here, who's working here as well. Uh, he's helped us a lot to retrieve the discharge files. We, we, have, we have given him a lot of um, IP numbers, OP numbers. He helped us a lot. He didn't even say a word. He's been very helpful to us. So I'm thanking him on behalf of my entire team. Thank you.
for the medical audit we sorted out all the files for a week of november that is from 20th of november to 26th of november of all the departments so uh, before uh, 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 doing the audit we prepared a deficiency checklist comprehensive which is comprehensive and it consisted of 39 components so which we, uh, we took all the files each and every file and went through uh, the attachment if, if it is in chronological order or not so and the signature completeness of the file and everything so after this we compiled all the data and we did a data analysis uh, to see where uh, the loopholes are found much Well, so far we have done all the assessment and auditing of the files. Now we are moving on to the analysis of the data, whatever we have collected. But there was a confusion because we had 17 departments and there were 39 components in the deficiency checklist what we had framed. So the confusion was such that how to frame the uh, analysis part and go on with the analysis. So it is a great help from the Dr. Nandukumar who guided us in a path where we can choose our data analysis in a proper way. Here what we have done is we have selected four categories under the deficiency checklist components that is administrative, patient care, surgical and supportive. Under these four categories we have divided the 70 departments and all the 39 components accordingly and we have started doing the data analysis. Under this data analysis, we could find that most of the incompleteness is seen in the patient care part, which is followed by the administrative category, surgical, and finally the supportive. This is how the graph shows, which indicates and also helps us to reach our objective. This is the graph. So next. After completion of this one, we have come up with the findings, conclusion and recommendations. Thank you. So this was a gist of our 30 days process. We tried to fill in everything in a small nutshell. It's been a month now we are working together. We began our work with the first two weeks of data collection. And we also focused on literature, uh, literature reviews. By the middle of third week, we started compiling the collected data and started interpreting it and we were so enthusiastic to find our results and at the end of third week it was successful to find our results and with the great joy we also started working on uh, presentations and e-posters this project made a solid confidence and foundation to take up any further challenges me on behalf of my teammates would like to thank our mentor for her great guidance, Dr. Sarla Ma'am. And a special thanks to Dr. Narendra sir for always being a great support and without him we wouldn't land here. 
and would also like to thank all the staffs, faculties, and a special thanks to MRE staffs for always supporting us. Thank you. Was excellent in carrying out the instructions given by Narendra Nath sir and by me also, and they worked hard to fulfill the university criteria. I wish them all the best for their presentation. Thank you.